Have you guys ever experienced the reason why Minecraft never runs with the shaders mod and it always comes up with enable client window version default mini dumps not enabled on Windows or anything like that? Well, I've got good news for you because I'm here to tell you how to fix it. Okay guys, so the issue is, it's got nothing to do with your windows, and you probably looked around and said, What is wrong with it? And all this other stuff. And uh, the issue is only actually what processor you're running with. So I'm in my NVIDIA control panel, I've made my way to manage 3D settings. So and what's happened is, you've actually got your um, selected profile on, um, and what you're running it with on in integrated graphics not interrogated or no wonder it's went, uh, not working because yeah um or that was a terrible pun or you're um using this one which is also auto selected on integrated as well you need to go um to your high performance nvidia processor or if this works with amd radian i don't know and your amd uh, radian catalyst control center will probably be a setting that allows you to uh, say something like use with high performance AMD catalyst and your graphics card and um, if you change to that it will work look I'll do it with my integrated settings just give me a second guys okay guys so this is me with the integrated settings um, uh, so you can see for yourself I'm running it with integrated settings and I've applied it and uh, this is now running Minecraft with uh, uh, the integrated Intel HD graphics card. So uh, you'll see what happens. And um, yeah, once it loads, if it actually does. It. Okay, guys. Oh, Jason, Jason, Jason. All right. What's he been up to? Um, he made the hit screen title thing. And uh, so loading word, building terrain, expecting to get in, and. Minecraft not responding, and there's your big crash. Failed to write core dump, mini dumps not enabled by a default on client version of Windows. There's nothing wrong with your Windows, trust me. And now all you need to do, go to your high performance NVIDIA processor, apply, and then watch this once it's finished applying. There we go. Now I want to go and run Minecraft one more time. Last time, guys. Bear with me. We're almost done. Trust me. My mouth tastes like strawberries, I don't know why, but I don't like strawberries. And you're probably like, what? He doesn't like strawberries anyway. Hmm. Oh well. Uh, so now loading with our high performance NVIDIA processor. This time it will work, guys. Just, just watch and learn. See, and if you don't believe me, here it is once more again. High performance NVIDIA processor. Remember, we clicked apply. Um... Don't worry about it, not responding, it will respond. Boom, there you go. Joining a game again. Loading world, building terrain. Here it goes, moment of truth. And boom. Look at that. Shaders mod working with our 1.8.9 compatible uh, Optifine Minecraft. Uh, here's a link now if you want to go check out how to play shaders with Optifine. Because you will get better frames, trust me. So um, thank you very much for watching, hopefully it's helped you guys out. I'm using the Ultra Motion Blur effects, so that's why when I move it's all like blurry and stuff in the background, which is cool. Um, until next time, hopefully this has helped you out. If it hasn't, don't be afraid to comment and say, it didn't work. I'll come to your guys' aid with another video or something. Thank you very much for watching, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.